Forklifts are used widely to improve the efficiency of logistical distribution systems. However, this convenient transporting machine may be the cause of serious accidents or casualties if used incorrectly. In order to prevent accidents and or casualties, basic operation of the reach forklift is explained in this video. Before starting any operation with a forklift, ensure the forks are in the proper safe position in accordance with the load or type of pallet to be handled. The recommended width between the forks is one-half to three-fourths of the width of the pallet. When adjusting the position of the forks, place them symmetrically to the center of the forklift. Take extra care to protect hands and fingers from becoming caught in the forks. Before getting on, inspect the front and rear surroundings by indication and vocalization. Grasp the framework of the forklift securely with both hands and place your left foot on the step so your body is supported at three locations. Get on slowly. Adjust the rear view mirrors to establish optimum visibility. Getting on or off the forklift or adjustment of the pads is permitted only when the forklift is stationary. Never grab the steering wheel or any operation levers. Jumping on and off is strictly prohibited. After turning the key switch to the on position, confirm that the LCD meter panel is lit. Grasp the steering knob with your left hand. Operate the mast lever with your right hand. Lift the forks 5 to 10 centimeters above the top surface of the straddle arms. Tilt the forks fully backward. Before starting the forklift, Always inspect the vicinity by indication and vocalization. When safety has been confirmed, fully depress the brake pedal and move forward by shifting the accelerator lever into forward. Now to right angle turns. Drive forward to the center of the aisle and approach the corner gradually. When the front wheels reach the corner, start turning the steering wheel. When the middle section of the forklift arrives at the center of the aisle you're entering, return the steering wheel quickly to the straight position. Next, right angle turns in reverse. Drive the forklift backward down the center of the aisle. When the front wheels are about one meter from the corner, confirm the corner to turn. Turn quickly when the front wheels pass the corner. When the middle section of the forklift arrives at the center of the aisle you're entering, Return the steering wheel quickly to the straight position. When you drive, you must observe the following. If the load blocks your vision, drive backward. If necessary, ask someone to assist you. Adhere to the turning ability of the forklift. Drive slowly. Always be aware of any obstacles, personnel and surroundings. Keep your elbows and heels inside the forklift. Maintain the correct driving posture. Now to loading. Approach and square up to the load. Take your left foot off the brake pedal to stop the forklift at about 20 to 30 centimeters before the load. 
Shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Level forks. Lift them to the height of the pallet openings. Inspect the right and left surroundings by indication and vocalization. Depress the brake pedal and move forward slowly by shifting the accelerator lever into forward. Reach out and insert forks completely into the pallet. Take your left foot off the brake pedal. Shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Then, lift the pallet about 10 centimeters above the pallet stand. Please be aware of the following to prevent any rollover accidents when loading. Only handle loads which are within the forklift loading capacity indicated on the load plate. Ensure the load is stable. Avoid unbalanced loads. Do not allow anyone onto the pallet. Do not allow anyone underneath the lifted pallet. Reach in the mast to the maximum position. Inspect the right and left surroundings by indication and vocalization. Depress the brake pedal with your left foot and move backward by shifting the accelerator lever into reverse. Stop the forklift when the distance between the pallet stand and the front end of the pallet is about 20 to 30 centimeters. Take your left foot off the brake pedal. Shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Then, lower the forks about 5 to 10 centimeters above the top surface of the straddle arms. Tilt the forks fully backward. Inspect the right, left, and rear surroundings by indication and vocalization. Drive the forklift to the pre-designated area. Now, on to unloading. Approach and square up to the pallet stand. Take your left foot off the brake pedal. Stop about 20 to 30 centimeters before the pallet stand. Shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Level forks. Lift the forks about 15 centimeters above the height of the unloading position. After inspecting the right, left, and front surroundings by indication and vocalization, slowly depress the brake pedal. While checking the unloading position, shift the accelerator lever into forward and move forward slowly. Stop the forklift at the pre-designated area. Take your left foot off the brake and shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Reach out the forks to the unloading position. Slowly lower the pallet. Make sure to clear the pallet, load and forks while reaching in the mast to the maximum position. After inspecting the right, left, and rear surroundings by indication and vocalization, shift the lever into reverse. Stop the forklift when the distance between the pallet and the front end of the forks is about 20 to 30 centimeters. Take your left foot off the brake pedal and shift the accelerator lever into neutral. Then, slowly lower the forks 5 to 10 centimeters above the top surface of the straddle arms. Tilt fully backward. Inspect the right, left, and rear surroundings by indication and vocalization. Drive the forklift to the pre-designated area. Finally, let's study parking procedures and getting off the forklift. 
Take your left foot off the brake pedal and stop the forklift. Lower the forks until fully resting on the ground. Turn the key switch off. Disconnect the battery plug. Remove the key and store it in a designated secure location. Forklifts can cause serious accidents. Do not execute any abrupt operations, such as abrupt acceleration, abrupt braking, or abrupt turning. Operation of the mast while the forklift is moving is strictly prohibited. As much as having the accurate knowledge, it is important to be calm enough to follow each and every step, even during busy operations. Observe the basic operation of the forklift and focus on safe operation in your daily working environment.